Hello, David here, and the project for today is a repair on this electric lawnmower. This is a corded electric lawnmower. It's not cordless. It doesn't have a battery. It's a Black & Decker model MM275, 18-inch mulchy mower. And the problem was it didn't have full power. When you plug it in and uh, push the, the power switch, it would go on full power, and then it would die. It would either cut out altogether, or it would... Uh, resort to a, a very low power setting. At first I thought it was possibly uh, it was a variable speed switch, but no, that's not the case. It's a one speed switch. It's either off or it's on at full power. I already made the repair, but I could show you how to fix it. This is a switch. It's full power all the time now. And I knew it was a switch because when I was operating it before the repair, uh, when I moved the switch slightly, when I would, would jiggle the switch, it would cause it to go back to full power from, from half power or being totally off. And there's not many moving parts on these electric motors. There's a motor and there's a switch and there's a cord and that's about it. I'm sure other manufacturers are uh, designed in the same exact manner. Uh, to start with, let's remove the power cord for safety reasons. On the other side of the handle, there's a Phillips screw. Remove the screw. And don't lose this nut. I'm just going to put them together so they don't get misplaced. I folded the handle over so you could see the underside of the switch. There are one, two, three, four, five screws on the back that are Torx. Use a T15 for that. All the screws loosen, just lift up on the cover, it's a two-piece cover. Careful not to lose the screws. That one's not all the way out. There we go. Also be careful about the switch. On this model there's a spring. There's a spring for this handle right here that could fall off when you remove the handle. But you don't really need to remove the handle, but it might fall off on, on you and I want you to know about it. This handle actuates this switch right here. This is a switch to replace on this Black & Decker model. The switch is number 681064-01 and you'll find it for anywhere from $18 to $25 on the internet. But in my fix, I actually didn't replace the switch. I pulled it out and I have some electrical contact cleaner for a, a, uh, a map sensor on an automobile. And there's a hole in there's a hole in there, that square hole right there. I took the, the straw from the spray can, stuck it in there and sprayed it liberally with the electrical contact cleaner. And then I worked the switch in and out and in and out. And then I held it in, sprayed it again, worked it in and out. Then I dried out the contact cleaner, put it back together, and that's what did the fix. So uh, reassembly is the exact reverse procedure of disassembly. So I want to thank you guys for watching, and I hope this repair helps you out on repairing your lawnmower.